come on to join us with just a commentary so we're gonna act a video um of the matching band in thailand of course this video came as a request i'm gonna check it out of course thank you so very much for requesting it don't forget like us on facebook follow us on twitter if you want me to react to video leave a comment below i'll be more than happy to react to it of course thank you so very much let's go ahead let's see oh nice band beautiful colors blue wheat they're in a line boy they're in line and of course the picture of the king <coughs> the kings behind there, King Rama the Ninth, King Rama the Tenth. I'm seeing their pictures there. Awesome. And the people quietly and attentively watching this awesome match. They have the, they have the line. So the, they have the blue. I think this video request came in after the boys all from Thailand were rescued. Um, so this is this is just showing us how great it is that they organize, and of course the amount of effort that goes into this team. The Thai Navy, the Thai SEAL, the Thai Police, they're, they're so organized. I love the big picture of the king they've got there. Wow. And look at their hat like pointy boy. I don't know how long, how long do they take to practice before this grand event. It reminds me of Alice in Wonderland, the matching cards, you remember? Wow. That is so neat. So every when do they have this matching event? Like is there a specific time of the year that they have the matching event? Wow. It's in such line. Wow. Oh my god. Look at that, look at that. Oy. So we saw the blue and the mixed colors and then there's a red. But it's a very, it looks like the rain want to fall today. If you watch, the sky is grayish. So this, that, these are like the navy blue. And they all have different purposes. They all have something. They all have a meaning. The colors have a meaning. And they're all important. Did this not pigeon go there? Wow. The saints go marching in, oh when the saints go marching in, oh I love to be in a number, when the saints go marching in, oh when the saints go marching in, go marching in, oh when the saints go marching in, oh how I love to be in the number oh when the saints go marching in <laughs> wow that is awesome so they are dressed differently who are they what is their the uniform I'm representing in red right there oh wow. I know oh students or the nurses. I wouldn't be surprised if like they had nurses, maybe, or doctors, or they are they also, or they are students. Yeah, they they appear to be students. Either students in the navy or or, or something. And then teachers behind there. Scouts, of course. It looks like this is like scout group and young navy seals and so on and so forth wow there, there are so many yo so many group groups wow so they, they, they at the back they look like they might be nurses, they're looking like nurses and our persons in the medical field. Wow. 
That's a long match and to do, but I think it's worth it. Is that a fan out there? Did I just, guys, it's that hot? I saw there's a fan at the back there. The fan is actually turned on. I'm not quite sure if I catch it again in the video. <laughs> you guys tell me Thailand is hot, hot, hot. Yeah, yeah, you see, look, they have fun behind there. They have fun behind there. What? And although the weather looks very nice and cool. Wow. Oh, guys, thank you for requesting this video. Sometimes a very simple video is a very great video. I love it. Shows the coordination, of course, and the people out of Thailand, the Navy, the Army, the hospitals, the doctors, all of them play a critical part. Of course, this is part two. We're gonna check out. Oh, sorry, this is part one. We're gonna check out part two right now. Oh, let's see, let's see. So we just watched part one of the video request. Hey, there's fun all over the place. Is it that hot? There's fun outside. Wow, is it that hot guys? There's need for fun outside. But it seems very windy and gusty though. Wow. Yo! That's the tri well, tribone. I think it's called a tribe, but I'm not quite sure. <laughs> it's very windy, it seems. It seems like it's windy. I'm seeing some ghosts going across there. N not quite sure. What's that? Or is it just the fan that is on? Yeah, it looks like the fan. Why is the fan blowing out there? It's like some kind of... What is that misty thing? Is that cool? Oh, this fan got me, got me very distracted, guys. <laughs> the fan got me very distracted. Ah, it's actually muffling the sun. Ooh. Ooh, they took a different direction there suddenly. Wow. I like how they're turning there. It's like, Oh, they, were they all going down that way? And maybe I didn't notice this from the first time. Is that where they were all meant to go? But you guys have to tell me why this was with the fan. And is a fan, fan blowing something like powder or mist? It seems like something is blowing out of the fan. The fan has got me very much distracted. <laughs> and the next group, of course, looks like a bunch of more of youngsters. Ooh, that group looking very much organized. Yo! And they all represent different parts, okay? They have Navy SEALs, they have got the police, the firemen, the, the, the soldiers, the army, the, I think the King's Guard, um, this sort of people, all sorts there. The Scout, Scout group, um, the Young Navy group, all kind of groups, schools. Ooh, there's a lot! But all these groups are needed in Thailand to protect the people of Thailand, to save the people of Thailand in times of disaster, to protect the king, of course, the royal family. So they are all important in Thailand and they play a meaningful role. Furthermore, some of my friends who I have on Facebook got, I'm joined the, even not the army, but the Navy SEAL this year, and it was such a remarkable thing. You know, I've been reacting to the video when persons are selected when they have to put their name, pull a tag out of the basket, and to find out that some of my friends from Facebook actually join. That is awesome, that's great. Wow, so these ones they have a bright blue. There's a fly in the room. I, I, I can hear it. There's a fly in the room. I don't like flies. Oh god, I, I got it, did I? In my room, it's coming my way. It's gonna come my way. I'm sorry to get distracted by the fly. Got it. I think I got it. <laughs> okay. Bright blue, of course. I know what I like about the groups. It's not just a few. It's massive. The groups are big. They're a lot. And I'm quite sure they're a lot more than those who are actually paraded right now. They're a lot more in each group.
I like how the Thai people laugh to sit down and watch the parade. They're not just standing and shorting. They're almost, they have the legs go sitting down to watch the parade. Humble, very humble people from Thailand. And everyone is filming and so attentive. So the changing course it looks like. Seems like they're changing course now, so some they're not going in one direction. That's what I thought because at the beginning of the video, I'm quite sure they never they were not coming up that bend there. So it looked like they changed different um, directions. Wow. Wow. A lot of the Thai people taking the, their, their culture is very seriously taking the whole moving. The navy, the the, the, the the rule and governance and protection of the people of Thailand, very serious. And I think we saw we all what the video have been reacting to the commercials, the, the stories that we've seen it with the rescue in Thailand. I think that is one of the most extraordinary things that we've seen the, the, the togetherness, the unity, the, the strength. I, there was a lot that we see, and there's a lot more stories coming out from this um, cave rescue, of course. A lot more stories. I got like four videos to react to in regards to the, the, the cave rescue. There's a lot more that we have to see. And then, uh, the fly is back. The fly is back. The fly just came back. Oh, that's it. God, gotcha! I definitely got this time. You know, this group here reminds me almost like a Chinese sort of religious group. I'm not quite sure they, or like a karate kind of group. That's what they remind me of, like a Chinese karate religious sort of group. I'm not quite sure. So, of course, you guys will comment below and tell me what exactly does this group represent. They're looking like a fighting sort of defensive group. You know what I mean? Out from the, the Chinese sort of movies, it's like the king defending guards, like. Or the king's fighting group or something like that <laughs> of course comment below let me know what exactly it represents also basically it's the same people yeah that's why you guys are okay that's why it's part i can hear the flight it's not dead yet i can hear the flight it's not dead yet okay so these are the same group but they are in a different angle it looks like this is from a different angle so these are looking like the skull groups, of course there's a feather in the hat or something. So this one seems like a skull group. They're walking much faster. And they're not, <laughs> you know that the first group when they were going, you could actually see they were walking in step. This group is a bit more relaxed there. So they seem like nurses or, or they're very much relaxed. You guys can clearly see they are much more relaxed in their walking. <laughs> they're much more relaxed in their walking there. That is amazing though, that, that is amazing. Um, they might be nurses and such, but they're, they're, that is just great. Of course you guys requested this video two videos of course and i will respect every video that you guys request i would love to learn and learn more of thailand because one day i will visit thailand and it's good to learn this culture and the different things that a lot of things i've learned about thailand that's much different from my culture and sort of helping me right now in my own country for example i noticed in a video or i noticed basically all the thai people are very much respectful and humble when they're always doing um the bow and the gracious or when they're always showing compassion and since then watching the videos i've should try to portray that in my country by let's just say when a vehicle is passing i do stuff like that i don't do that because this is not a common culture but i do stuff like that i always do like a little nod to show respect and someone actually observed another bus driver observed me once when i did that when someone stopped to allow me to pass the, uh, across the road and i did that almost in a humble way and since then this bus driver always sees me and always even before i stop the bus to, to get a ride to go to my destination always stop and remind me to continue doing that and he loved the fact that when i was when the vehicle stopped for me to pass i i sort of bow my head like that for them to pass for me to pass showing gratitude and acknowledgement of 
what they did for me of course thank you so very much for your question like us on facebook follow us on twitter if you want me to react to video leave a comment below i'm gonna try my utmost best to react to it of course thank you so very much bye guys